Hi folks, I'm Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness. On May 4, 2020, we posted a video asking for your help for sick, starving, and injured cows on a farm in Kendall County, Illinois. Many of you responded, and I am so happy and grateful to now tell you that the situation has improved significantly. Shark was back out yesterday filming the cows both from the ground and in the air. The Kendall County Sheriff's Office responded initially with three deputies, but what began as a tense meeting ended up being productive. We've done our due diligence for them to check on you guys and make sure that your operation was being conducted legally, and as far as we can tell, it is. Generally, we were pleased with the professionalism and responsiveness of the Sheriff's Office. The good news is that the cows have been moved from the mud hole they were mainly in to an area with much more grass, and the cows were clearly taking full advantage. One of the issues we didn't even cover initially was that the fencing in the area where the cows were held was pushed down, and the cows were simply walking through and over, right onto a 55 mile per hour road. The area where the cows have been moved to has good fencing and should keep them from coming to harm. We located one of the injured cows we had seen earlier. She has now been isolated from the other cows, and we hope she's getting proper care. We'll try to get more information on this animal. The farmer has now buried the cow that he initially tried to hide. Thank you to everyone who contacted the Illinois Department of Agriculture, the Kendall County Sheriff's Office, and Kendall County Animal Control. Some of you wrote to us about the response from Animal Control, which rather loudly protested being included in the contact list for this issue. I can assure you that their protests notwithstanding, they needed to hear from you, and Animal Control did put pressure on the Department of Agriculture. In a situation like this, you have to make noise. The Illinois Department of Agriculture has demonstrated for decades that it will do as little as it can get away with, the bare minimum possible. We have long called the department worse than worthless for a reason. The department's response to a situation is directly affected by how much of a shitstorm is created around it. Thank you for stirring that pot, which has resulted in positive change. The Department of Agriculture didn't communicate with us at all, but clearly our calls for action did make things happen. One deputy sheriff acknowledged that they did indeed call on the Department of Agriculture to get its act together. Things I, I know that there's, this has been an issue. It's something that we've been trying to address the best way we can by involving the appropriate agencies like the Illinois Department of Agriculture and so we've moved a few steps in the right direction, but there are still animals with skin conditions and injured animals, and the grass in this field will not last long for this many cows. We'll need to keep an eye on this issue, and I hope we can count on your continued support. I'm Steve Hindy for showing animals respect and kindness. Thank you for watching. Please like and share this video. You can subscribe to our channel to see more of our investigations and learn what you can do to help shark help animals. To support shark directly and gain access to exclusive content, consider sponsoring us on Patreon.